PNG has had its own tragic experience with domestic passenger ship accidents. Eleven lives lost when the Rabaul Queen succumbed to the unforgiving seas of Morabe, what was described today as still the most fatal in the Asian Pacific region. While the nation's maritime authority earned praise today for providing detailed reports of the incident, PNG falls in a category with many Asian Pacific nations yet to draft a regulatory framework in line with IMO requirements. Captain Ostaglu said the lack of an adequate and comprehensive regulatory framework hinders the implementation of ferry safety. Among an extensive list of issues to be reviewed by IMO, the practice of using second-hand ships has been tagged as one of the leading causes of accidents at sea. According to Neil Baird with the Australian National Centre for Oceanic Research and Security, 36% of the time it was the cause. IMO reports revealed that the passenger ferries imported into the Pacific region, including P&G, are old and possibly not appropriate for operating in our seas. The organization now strongly advises that sea vessels be determined seaworthy before they are used to avoid unfortunate accidents and to get an appropriate national legislation drafted to establish guidelines sooner than later. Melissi Gaviro, National MTV News.